How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back aboard the Nostalgia Train. Welcome to Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch Remastered. Nino Kuni is definitely one of my favorite RPGs ever made. Let's go ahead and get into it. Um. Just because I'm trying to do this for story purpose, I am going to 100% it, but easy mode. If I think it's too easy, I'll swap over to normal, but that's... If I remember this game, that's very unlikely to happen. <laughs> this is very pretty, by the way. Okay, kid, you need to... Get a move on, Ollie boy! Slow down, Mr. Drippy. Yeah, I can't run that fast. Huh? Um. Huh? Hi. <laughs> Stampede! Yeah, because that's smart. That is a smart way to go about that. Let's get going, shall we? Where? Hey, wait for me! I. <sighs> Your world. That's right. A whole nother world. Yep. <laughs> and then we got our introduction sequence right here. Level five. I remember the only other game I've ever played by level 5 was Dark Cloud. I never finished it. You'd be able to find it on the channel, actually, because it is a good game. That's why I kept it on. It's just not one that I'd be willing to go thoroughly all the way through and play, unlike this game. I don't know if I'd be willing to 100% this game, but I'd definitely be willing to do all the tasks up at least until the end. But. There are post-game sequences, so there is that. Kind of makes it a bit more complicated. I don't know. I don't know. The post-game stuff I would consider more like 101, 102, that kind of thing. But that's me. That's me personally. This game has some freaking awesome bosses. I'm going to say that. Excuse me? Okay, th all right then. Can we get to the actual game now, please? Thank you. <laughs> all right, let's go. Welcome to Motorville. Drive safe. We want to do more than that safe nowadays, hon. <laughs> How about be careful? That might be smart. Good Just morning, saying. Why, good morning, Hi. Mama. Your groceries are over there, honey. Thanks. Well, thank you much. Oh, I almost forgot. Did Philip find you? He said he had something to show you here. Really? So he finally finished it, huh? Do you know where he is right now? He just stepped out with some deliveries for me. Well, good grief. Thanks, Miss Layla. Oh, say hi to your mother for me. <laughs> hey, Miss Layla! I got something for you, Miss Layla. Miss Layla, he's calling my name. Hey, Miss Layla. <laughs> Over here. I see you. Hi. Oh, it's Phil. I know. I know how to control the character. Thanks. Hi. Good thing you found me. Guess what? She's finally ready. Hey, Miss Layla, she's ready. <laughs> so what Miss Layla said? Is it really what I think it is? What else would it be, dum dum? Rude! Miss Layla, he's being me. Boy, you 
sure something else fell. So what do we do now? What else? We take our first spin. Tonight. Um... Are we sure this is a good idea? What? Tonight? Well, I can't. I mean, I need to ask my mom. And... Sure, sure. You go ask your mom. And then when do we do it, huh? Tomorrow? Next year? <sighs> oh, boy. Well, I... No, but... Don't patronize me! I'll get Miss Layla. <laughs> He's gonna do so much. Okay, we'll do it tonight. But we'll have to be real quiet. Fine. Sure we will. Okay, tonight in my garage. Be there or be square. I'd rather be a square in this situation, buddy. Sure. I know that's not what that term means, but whatever. So, this is the child. Yes, White Witch, it is. Hmm. The Dark Jinn's power alone will not suffice. And if no. What is the child's name? Oliver Yo-Yo Dukes. Oliver? Yeah. That's his name. I know. Dude, I know. Yes! I almost went the wrong way. <laughs> Miss Layla, I almost went the wrong way. <laughs> Are you even listening to me? <laughs> Miss Layla, pay attention to me. I'm such I'm like I'm such ugh. I'm like such a child. Hi. Good morning, Oliver. Oh my! Just look at these leaves and branches all over the ground here. What an awful mess. Sorry. Alright, let's go in the house. Hi, Mom. Hey. Hi. I got the groceries. Thanks, sweetie. Just pop them on the table, will you? Okay. Say, Mom. Hmm? Did you say something, sweetie? Um, you're no! Busy tomorrow. I was talking to Layla. Miss Layla over now there. To mention it, I do have to practice for my concert in the morning. Oh, yeah? So, you'll be in bed kind of early, huh? Red mm -hmm. flag! Course, red flag! Motherly red flag right oh, there. You will, huh? <laughs> will you stop being so mysterious and eat your breakfast? You'll be Suspicious would have been the better word. Mm. I chew before you swallow. Mm. Yeah, you know, unless you want to choke on the food, which I highly doubt. I don't recommend. Just saying. Thanks for breakfast, Mom. See you later, Mom. Bye, bye Mom. Guys. I have no idea where I'm going, but bye, Mom. Hello. <laughs> hey, Phil. You didn't go to school yet? Ha! School is small. Today's a special day, kiddo. Today's the day our dream machine finally rolls off the drying board and onto the streets of Motorville. If you say so. Oh boy! I can't wait! When can I see it? Whoa there, cowboy, not so loud. Don't forget this is our secret. Hey, dum dum. Get to, would you stop that? I will tell Miss Layla. Wow. If this was actually what our character said, you'd be such a tattletale. <laughs> you didn't tell your mom about it, did you? No! No, I did not. I asked her if she was busy. She said she had... Oh my gosh. The way you said it, though, set off a lot of red flags, kid. Perfect. Then tonight's the night. You still in kiddo? Sure I am. Tonight at your garage, I'll be there. Stupid idea. Really, really stupid idea. She must be asleep by now. Nito! She's out like a light. Now's my chance. I have to get to Phil's garage. Okay. 
Okay, now I can actually open the menu, but it's pretty much pointless right now. I mean, all you can... What did I just say? I know. But again, it's... What's the point? Okay. Time to go visit Miss Layla. I'm gonna go this way and go... This isn't the way to Phil's garage. Oh. Is Miss Layla at Phil's garage? I've got a problem. I've got... I've got a... I think I've got a... A, small, a tiny addiction. Maybe. Probably. This way. I don't wanna... Fine. Dang that animation. Hi. That's an echo. What are you looking at? Atari? What is it with that kid? What kept you, Slowpoke? Sorry, my mom just wouldn't go to bed. <laughs> is it finished? Sure is. The last bearing's in, and she's primed for action. Wanna see? Do I ever? Alright. Oh boy. How old are the two of you? Here goes nothing. Okay. I'm pretty sure Ollie here is just like 12 years old or something. So, so neat. You betcha. It's so neat. <laughs> the new Coupe Deluxe ain't got nothing on us, Ollie. It's not even close. So, you ready to hit the road, kiddo? Yeah! <laughs> Ollie must be younger than he is. Okay, there's nobody around. We should take her outside now. So, uh, Phil, who gets to drive for- That's a stupid question! Huh? Hmm, let me see now. Tell you what, kiddo. If you run down the street and make sure the coast is clear, I'll let you go first. You mean that? Oh boy, oh boy! Uh, okay. Wait right here. And watch out for Starry Mary, will ya? Starry Mary? You know, the girl has been watching us. She looks a lot like Miss Layla. I think she may be a shrunken version of her. Hey, Miss Layla. Yeah? I knew it. <laughs> See? There she is again. I'll bet that tattletale goes straight to her olds. She wouldn't do that. What are you, sweet on her or something? You have no idea. <laughs> I mean, I didn't say nothing. <laughs> totally. Mini Miss Layla, I'm totally not into her. That's crazy. <laughs> Gosh dang it. Sure thing, Phil. I'll be right back. Hey, babe. Hey, babe, you want to smooch for a bit? Want to do some smooching? It's like, mwah, mwah, mwah. Coast is clear. I better go tell Phil. Don't go. Hi. It's a bit early, yeah. don't you think? Please, Oliver. Don't go. Oh, uh, Green Bean, I kind of have to you? get to my car. How do you know my name? Ollie. What's taking you so long? I'm sorry, Phil. Green Bean kind of messaged me and Thank got in the way. Who was it? Oh, uh, that girl over there. What are you talking about? Well, there's nobody there. Shush! There was someone there. She was right there. I'm not crazy. A girl. Okay, maybe a little bit. <laughs> I bet it was that dumb, scary Mary. Oh no, couldn't be. She's not allowed out. Uh, is that really? Wait, uh, oh yeah, right. Anyway, come on. Oh, oh, okay. Ow! Frickin' I hit my desk. Ow! <laughs> Used the term persistent, but that works. Might this 
this one not through equally with me. What would you have me do, Lily? That is a good term to but use. Must not be suffered to grow. Very well with your ladies. Oh boy. Screw you! I'ma go tell Miss Layla. I really have a problem with Miss Layla right now. <laughs> I mentioned her like a bajillion times in the past fifty. Ooh. Oh boy. Everything's okay, mommy. I'm asleep. Please don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Oh boy. Ah, crap. Where are you? Oliver? <sighs> okay, jokes aside, I don't Oliver. like this next part. Um, you're kind of busy tomorrow. Finally, the red flags are actually flashing. The red light, whatever. The red lights are waving, the red flags are flashing. Same difference. Oliver. Oh. oh, gosh. Okay, for a moment I was hearing the Halloween theme song. I don't I don't know. Not that. I don't I I'm not hearing it now, but Is it weird that I feel like I'm smelling gasoline IRL even though That's so weird. Oh boy. Lots of fun. Hope we don't get into a crash or anything. <laughs> uh oh. Um Ollie, if I uh oh. Like what's happening? Oh, jeez. Oh boy. This is why I don't like this scene. You start the game, you hit me with the feels on the first freaking video. <laughs> Within the first 20 minutes. Come on! <laughs> Don't 
do this to me. <laughs> I've played this game so many times, and this still gets me. Every freaking time. Shut up! I can go out and miss Layla. <laughs> I mean, she kind of looks after me, don't she? I mean, she's the only one I've seen so far. Actually, yes, I agree with that statement. But still, you're a prick. Well, of course you are, you're the antagonist. You're the main villain of the story. Yeah. Yeah, Miss Layla. I'll just leave it here for you, okay, dear? <sighs> Wait, Miss Layla, no, don't. <laughs> Just have to wait until dinner to return. <laughs> so sad. He's been in there three whole days now. Please tell me he's eating something. Oliver, mommy's not doing her job today. She's asked someone very special to do Aww. it for you. Mommy spent a long time making him. Oh. Sure, he'll look after you very well. Stop hitting me with the fields! What the hell? Is something wrong, sweetie? Just come back soon, okay? Oh. <laughs> we'll always be together, Oliver. Screw you! Miss Layla, I think my doll's possessed! Okay, that's normal. Yeah. Yeah, that expression. Huh? What just happened? You just witnessed the rebirth of Drippy, Lord High, uh, Lord of the Fairies. Um. <laughs> That's right, and I'm sick to the teeth of you were sniveling and moaning. A proper crybaby bunt in you are. Oh, shut up! I've been sad before, but crying for three old days, I'm surprised there's a drop of water left in you. You're a big boy, man. Three days is, well, it's a new dog. What? Uh, no, it's not. Oh, dear, bit flummoxed, a wee bit lost for words. Okay, Miss Layla, there's a something here criticizing me for being human. I want you to take it out. Or are you even listening to me? Uh huh. Wow, that was impeccable timing. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Come on, Trippy. Oh, okay. See, it's like this, see? What it is, is there's more worlds out there than this one by Earth. There's what you might call parallel worlds, see? They're like worlds along by the side of your one. And one of those worlds is my world. That's right, a whole nother world. Another world? That's quick you are. And I, that is the Lord High Lord of the Fairies. The reason I'm by here in this world of viewers, well, because there's a proper bad apple trying to upset the people. Dude, slow world. down. My the brain the can't keep up it. with you. What he did was he took over people's hearts and spread war and ruin all over the world. Uh, I tried to stand up to him, I did. And he turned me into a flipping uh, uh, me out of our world and into you as a rotter. Uh, and then you went and cried all over me and poof, the curse was lifted just like that. Which makes me think you must be the one we fairies call the pure hearted one. The one the legends say will save our world. 
<laughs> Shut up! Anyway, that means I better get you over to our world and have you get rid of Shadar for us. All right with you? Me? How can I? Don't miss Layla. It's a big responsibility, I know, but you'll be all right, especially with me to help you. But I. Uh, oh my brain! What? Oh, pure-hearted one, will you please come and save our world? I. Um, this is kind of a bad time. Sorry, I must have misheard you. What did you say? Go on once more, but louder. I won't do it. I, no. I mean, it's a bad time. This is why they say never work with children. I ask nicely, and you give me a hearty yes, sir. That's how this works. See, gee whiz, that would be swell. You say it's just how these things are done. It's tradition. Oh, uh, yeah, because we've totally still followed follow tradition from years ago. And I just can't like it. What, because your mom dropped dead? Okay, Miss Layla, get this thing out of my room. You got a photo of her? Uh. Hurry up, will you? I haven't got all day. Oh. Uh, okay. Let's see now. Blimey. It can't be. But then it can't be a coincidence, neither. What is it? The great sage Alicia. Then we might just be able to save your mom. Huh? Uh, you ready for another year full? No! The souls of people in your world and my world are connected. Which means people from over by you have another version of themselves over by there. Called a soulmate, see? And people with soulmates can even look like each other. Now, your mom, well, she shared a soul with the great sage Alicia. A proper talent she was. Okay, my brain is so really mother. starting to hurt now. But how does that help us save her? Well, Alicia tried to take on the dark djinn, but his power was too much for her, and he trapped her in this dark jewel called the soul snare. When that happened, then the link between hers and your mom's souls would have been cut off. But if you could free Alicia, it just might fix the link. And who knows, it might even bring your mom back. Is that really true? I can't be sure now, but it's possible, yeah. Okay. Wait. How do you know all this, Mr. Dribby? I mean, he works with Alicia, so... Ah, now there's clever of you. Good question, lad. It's like this, see? I'm not the only fairy. Even though I was stuck by you, my buddies were keeping me abreast of all the goings on over there. Now, I found I... what you might call a clarity. Miss Layla. Someone help me here. You know, I. <laughs> hmm? What is it? I'll. I'll do it. Oh, I'll sure, come yeah. Come I'll come with you and save my mom. Oh, that's marvelous. You might be doing it for all the wrong reasons, but if it's oh. the world, I won't look a gift horse in the mouth. Tidy, we better get going then. Chop, chop. Okay. But how do we get to your world? Oh, my oh, God. Okay, all right, I'll tell you. First thing we need is a drop of magic. Go and have a dig around in the fireplace. There's something hidden there so nosy parkers won't find it. But why would anybody hide something in there? That's for me to know and you to find out. Look lively. Sure. Yeah, why not? Ugh, Miss Layla, please, for the love of Pete, help! Trippy, Lord High Lord of the Fairies is back, man. Back and better than ever. Proper jaw I've got. Waking up and having to do a huge, great, long explanation like that's a lot to ask of a fairy. Even one as amazing as me. Trippy, Lord High Lord of the Fairies is back, man. Back and better than ever. You say anything else? Fireplace, man! Downstairs in the flippin' living room. Do you even flippin' live here? <laughs> yeah, I, I think. Okay, I guess that's all you say. Alright. Yes, I live here. Where the flip is Miss Leia? I need to sell you. I need to sell you on eBay or something. Stay. No. no, no. Bro, get over here. Here. Stay, stay, Drippy, stay, stay, you creepy little bastard. Stay where you are. N no. I swear. You move again. Well, son of a bitch!
All right, this thing better be in here. In a place like this. A mighty spell book. Huh? A book? But it will burn in there. Not this book. The wizard's companion laughs in the face of fire. Wouldn't be much of a spell book. Yeah. Now, would it? Really? Fair enough. Yeah. Uh -huh, okay. Gotcha. At least that made sense. I swear, if you give me another mouthful about this thing, Drippy, I am just going to rip you apart, sell you on Amazon, or maybe just directly towards Miss Layla. I ain't keeping you. Ah, okay, never mind. Drippy! Oops. Uh. You know, traditional name. Yes, I'm happy with the name Oliver. Alright. Tidy. Right. Magic in our way over to my world, is it? Hmm, now let's see. What are you doing? Wand somewhere by here? We can't go casting spells without a wand now, can we? A wand? Why would we have a wand? Oh, that's a pain. Ah, well, can't be helped. We'll just have to look for one outside. What? Not there either. Don't nitpick, crybaby bunting. Bunting? My name is Oliver. Oliver. Ah, so the crybaby bit was right at least, was it? Oh. <laughs> okay. I'll give you this, Trippy. That one was pretty good. But still, screw you. <laughs> Rito? Time to find ourselves a magic wand. You mean there's one hidden somewhere around here? Like a spell book? Ha! <laughs> You're having a laugh if you think I'm gonna make it that easy, Mum. What do you think I am? Made of wizarding equipment? Nah. This one's gonna be a little bit more difficult. But our journey over to my world is a hunt for the source now, among other things. So why don't you treat this as a warm up? The Easter egg hunt before the wild goose chase, if you will. Ah, good comparison. Uh huh. Um, okay, I guess. Miss Layla, I'm confused! Look at me. Price of my lovability is my small stature, ain't it? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> I only just managed to carry that flipping book, Mom. Any morning, I'd have been crushed. So even fairies tell lies, huh? Of course they do. These fairies are in horror. Oh my gosh. Anyway, no point in crying over spill milk. Let's find ourselves a substitute, shall we? How can we find a substitute? For a magic wand? Well, if you can find something brown and so a stick. We might just be able to muddle through. Okay. Sure a stick will work. You think I'm sending you up the garden paths to something? Fine. I'll give you a hint. Follow me, Bunting. You really like calling me Bunting, don't you? Eh? What are you looking at? Don't tell me you're thinking of using this lamppost. I'm looking at you, not the lamppost! You can't cut that out, though, Stott. It's way too flippin' big. We need a stick or something like that, ain't it? Why don't we go and have a look around over there? Uh, okay. I feel like looking around like this is pointless. Dude! This is one proper tidy motor, eh? Might get myself one of these. <clears throat> Sorry. That's not really the time, is it? No. There ain't anything one like over by there. Let's go and look over on the other side, shall we? When you find something, don't forget to pop it in your bag for safekeeping. Okay, finally the item bit. Jeez, that took forever. The bottomless bag. Alright. Let's go! That wasn't too bad. <sighs> it's no use. There's nothing around here that looks like a wand. You're not wrong, Bunting. Alright, we'd better split up then. Brought in the searchlight. 
I'll go and take another quick look around your house. You stay by here and head up the outside section, okay? Hey! Okay, brown and sticky. Brown and sticky. Where's Miss Layla? Brown and sticky. Wait. Something doesn't seem right about that statement. <laughs> Gee, I wonder what it is. Oliver! If I remember correctly. Huh? Yeah. Hi, Green Bean. <laughs> oh, it's you. Hi. You're, you're the little girl I met before, huh? Mm-hmm. We met before. Yeah. So, how do you know who I am? I'm really, really sorry, Oliver. Huh? For? I'm sorry. I couldn't save her. Huh? I don't... What? How would you for that? I wanted to save her. I really did. Huh? Hey, wait. Where are you? Wait, I... Uh... Where did you go? Ollie boy, why are you talking to thin air? I'm you not... You disappeared again. Huh? Who did? That strange girl. That's the second time she tried to talk to me. What's that? A girl? Where? You're right about strange. I can't see her any flipping where. That's because she's gone. You. She disappeared into thin air. Well, anyway, there's something I want to ask you. Oh, okay. Uh, sure. Go ahead. Do you mind it? You know, having a sidekick, like. Huh? A he's just like barely showing himself. Christ, is that cold? Who do you mean? He says, "Why not stab me in the heart while you're at it?" I mean, me. I wonder if it was all right me joining you on your adventure, or if you were maybe wanting to trade me in for a younger, prettier model. But it looks like I got my answer, huh? Well, so you know, if you don't, Wait, you're melodramatic. You never see their true worth. And what's more, look at this. I found a stick, Miss Layla. Can I keep it? Chuck it here, then. Well, no, not it's you. I. It's a wand. You mean a real wand? Come over by here and take a look, man. It might seem like any old stick, but it's got all magic writing on it. See? It does, huh? Wow. Okay then. Is that how people write in your world? The runes are all faded, so it might have lost a bit of power. But for our current purposes, it's a beauty. Neato. What a stroke of luck. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Green Bean left that for us. Do you think? Ah, that or Miss Layla. I don't know. Maybe Miss Layla's Green Bean. I know she's not, but you know, for the sake of the joke, <laughs> you obtained an old stick. Great. To cast our spell. To cast gateway, you need somewhere proper massive. That's not true. You need space to give it um. See? That's not true. We really need that much. Oomph? No. <laughs> yeah, what kind of question is that? Magic is special, isn't it? It's good, <sighs> right? Hey, Miss Layla, this guy's guying me. I don't appreciate it. Miss Layla's probably wouldn't even. If I did this so frequently to one person, the person would probably stop listening after the third or fourth time. Like, put on freaking headphones and go, <laughs> like, be listening to, I don't know, Nirvana or something. You have to cast spells in the best environment possible. Fine. You really are new to this, are you? This is beginner stuff we're talking about here. Well, no duh, I'm new to this. Oh, uh, sorry. Now, take me somewhere with plenty of space. It's got to be somewhere around by here. Um, the town square, I guess. Okay. Let's go to the town square then. Maybe we can go to Miss Layla's shop. That seems to be enough room, right? Right? Probably not even open, but we could try. Is that open? I guess they wouldn't be open at this time of day, huh? It's not even day, it's night. Get your time straight, kid. Fine. Cause Miss Layla's not, cause she's just exhausted of me now. Ugh. Do you really think we should be doing this here? No worries, man. 
Normal people can't see magic, see? Go on, Ollie boy, cast Gateway. Um... Okay, I guess. There we go, cast it. Show me what you got. I need some milk for my bones. Miss Layla, could you help? That didn't do crap, did it? <laughs> Fair enough. Alright. I guess I should start trusting what you say. be eyeing him too if he started saying that to me all right well onward to the next world yeah okay and at this point I'm assuming we've caught up with the story yeah it's been a while since I played this game I have played it quite a few times, but it, it, has, it has been a while. Let's get going, shall we? Huh? Hey, wait for me! <sighs> so this is... your world. Ah, home at last! But there's a tidy way to go yet. Hey, Mr. Drippy, that was pretty neat just now, huh? Oh, that's yeah. Not a bulk. Enjoy your first encounter with the majestic wildlife of our mysterious world, did you? Oh yeah, so majestic. Huh? Jeepers. That one, on the other hand. Where did he spring from? Uh, ah! What do we do? He's not like the big softies just now. He's itching for a fight. Proper savage. Let's run away. No, use that stick you got for that. Give him a whacking and send him back. Oh yeah, let's just beat him with a stick. Boom. Uh, Look lively, he's making his move. All right, well, I guess we're in our first battle now. I know how it works, Strippy. Shut up. Shut up. Shish! Ooh. And we're good. We win. That did nothing beneficial for me. Well, hey, proper tidy. Nice one, Ollie boy. Jeepers, creepers. Oh, you think you're done? You're not even close. Our world is absolutely riddled with beasties, but keep that up, and you'll have nothing to worry about. Right, let's get a move on, shall we? Uh, sure, Mr. Drippy. Oh, uh, oh, oh. Where are we going? Well, first off, we need to get you a wand. But I already have a wand. You're having a laugh, aren't you? That thing's about as magical as a flipping cabbage. You might just squeeze a gateway spell out of it, so you can forget about anything more than that. That's bullshit. Think before you open your mouth. Oh, sorry. Now, I How the hell am I supposed to know that, you dip? Well, if we're very lucky, we might find a wand with a bit more oomph somewhere there. So. Well, you're lucky I can't reach this Miss Layla now, otherwise I'd be shot for her. Well, time was you couldn't move for the flipping thing. But since Shadar showed up, magic's taken a real nosedive. He banned people from using it, see? Cursed anyone who tried to. He scared them all so much they gave it up. Yeah, that's why the pretty much what I was doing is what I have to say about Shadar. Well, he turned me into a flipping doll, didn't he? Just saying yeah. his name's enough to make most folks brick it. Still, I'd rather be a doll than have him go poking round in my heart. No one wants to be broken hearted. Yeah. Broken hearted? Like sad? Worse than that. Uh, 
Unfortunately, no. Steals a piece of a person's heart. Poor beggars don't know whether they're alive or dead. That's no way to live, man. Yeah, so that's I why agree. So you're scared of him, huh? We can't let him go on doing this. <sighs> well, it's not a matter of letting him, is it? It's not like people flipping enjoy it. That's why I brought you here, innit? You might just be able to stop him, see? You really think can you can? I? Of course you can. You are the pure hearted one. And the legends say that the pure hearted one will drive away the darkness. We'll teach you a few tasty spells and you'll be ready to face him in no time. Sound good to you? Yay! Okay, I'll do it. I'll learn. Well, that was firm and straightforward. Of course you will. And that's why we need to find you a better one. Yeah, okay. yeah. Let's head for Ding Dong Dell. Tidy. Okay. Next time. That was extensive. Oh, cool. Well, for right now, I am going to... Oh, sh ain't it beautiful, Alibaba? Ah, oh, it's gonna be back. Oh, okay. I know, I know. Shut up. Oh, yeah. Here. This is a little something. Consider the gift from the Lord High Lord of the Fairies. Thanks. I'm not going to read that. I know what to do with it. Okay. Before something tries to attack me, because that's a possibility, I'm going to leave this video here. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Nino you know, Kuni, Wrath of the White Witch, uh, remastered. If you liked it, uh, push that like button, and so far you can't see it anymore. If you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Have a suggestion for an RPG you'd like me to do on here? Let me know in the comments below. Want to check out um, another one that I've done prior to this game? I'll link to one across my head here. This game, once I've done enough videos, will be in the top right hand corner. In the meantime, I'm going to head off, but I'll catch you guys in the next uh, train ride.